As I say, we kind of messed up with the intro yesterday. But still, we've got the beach and the sand. So we'll go along here and we'll do a wee bit. Yesterday we never found very much. That's why I'm back today. So we'll see how we get on. Well, this is the terrain I'm digging in. It's like the surface of Mars. And I thought, the tides, tides not out yet. So we'll get a wee bash in here. And I came in on these rocks. I just don't believe it. There you go. A nice wee coin. I suppose it's all about getting the signals. And that's a coin. So, I'll clean it up and I'll show you it clean. That's a good wee coin find. Don't know what it is yet. But we'll soon find out. Okay, we've got a coin signal in here, under these rocks. See, and it is a coin. There's lots of old relic -y stuff kicking about. There we go, there's something in here. Get the wee trout. There it is. Big chunk of copper. Well, we're finding stuff anyway. Clearing the beach. I do it every time. I forget that in these crustaceans, big crusty rocks, you always find something interesting. Would have thought there'd have been a ball peen hammer in there. That's crazy. found that piece of molten copper and this looks like a good area it's quite flat rocky flat I can see a few things there's like a hammerhead thing there we're going to investigate that the aluminium tube so yeah we'll have a wee look here it's a shame it's no Valentine's Day because that looks like a heart or a set of Gabriel's wings. That's beautiful. Well, we dug another little hole here. And where's my pointer? Yeah, it's all crusty. Don't know what it is. It's hidden in there, it's a wee bit heavy. So we'll crack that open and round up and see what it is. Well this has certainly been a good wee spot. Don't know what that is. I ain't gonna clean it too much. Shame there isn't any puddles here. But we'll have a look at that in the round up. It might just be a penny. I think it might be. Okay, let's go. Pulled out another big lump from that hole. And I see it just the other side. I don't know what it is yet. Yeah, it's the Queen Elizabeth. Queen Elizabeth. Two shillings. And 1957, the year of my birth. How nice is that? Excellent wee find. Okay, we'll carry on, see what else we can find. Yesterday was a... Oh, hello. That's a wee doggy. How are you? It's another crusty, rusty bit of metal, so we'll crack that open at the roundup. And I have a look and see what's inside it. Tied it, so we might go over there, might not, I've got to go to work, so I'll probably finish up. I've, n I've never seen an albino one of these. 
We call them silver slaters. And that's an albino. Albino. Okay, it's hard going. Definitely hard going. But, in there, I don't know if you can see, but I can see. A little coin each. A little coin each. See what it is? Looks like... I don't know. Looks like I don't know what it is. But it is a coin. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, we shine. It might be a 2p, I don't know. Or a 2 bob. I know this is terrible. But it is the way you do it. Yeah, it looks like a 2 shilling or something. I'll clean that up and around that and let you see it. Right, this crusty piece of metal's got to be broken open because I can't take it. I've got too many in my bag. Well, I've got two or three. They're really heavy, so we'll crack this one open for you, live. Hopefully. See what's in it. And it ain't much. It's one of them. Why was it circular? God knows. But that's what it was. And you find lots of different things in them. So we'll see what's in the others when we do the roundup. When you see that sticking out of the sand, your heart misses a beat. I've looked at it and I put it back in to just show you. Get a wash. And there's the back of it. Just get it in focus. That's the back of it. And look who's on the other side. Mr. Labrador. What a shame he's lost that. That's nice. Oh well, no mind. Another wee great find. First time I've found one like that. That looks quite old. And it's got a phone number or something on the back, I don't know. Anyway, we'll move on. Well, again, nothing too spectacular. Yesterday I got a fork, today I got a knife. Um, there's the crustacean things I have to crack open. The ball peen hammer, that did break. I got a bottle top, ray of Dunfermline. It was still in the neck of the bottle, so I took it out. Another old crusty bit. Loads of ring pulls, bits of copper, a lead roof thing, nail thing, a bit of molten copper, just general junk, really. And then we've got the better stuff, we've got the dog tag, the old Labrador. Queen Elizabeth, two shillings. Old style, not spendable. An old two shillings again, it's probably Elizabeth or George. And an old penny, George V. This one I don't know what it is. I think it might be a penny with the state of it, the way it is, the condition. And this one, again, too far gone to see what's in it, but there's loads of stuff on the beach. It was a good day, second day, so it was nice. There's the other day's stuff. The 2p, me bit, the nice bit of china. And of course, the superhero hand. Ooh. So I'll crack these open and I'll let you see what's in them. Maybe I'll get another hammer like that. You never know. Thanks very much for watching my video. Please make a comment down there. Give me a thumbs up. Or you can subscribe over here. We subscribe button over here. Thanks very much. And I'll see you when I crack open these fellows. 
So here we are with the crustaceans we've got to smash up. That's the ball peen hammer from the one in the video. So we'll start with some of these. That's a bit of molten copper. So let's see what we've got. We'll start with this one. And that just looks like a pin, it's like a railway pin, the way it's shaped. Put that aside. Start this little one. Didn't think that one would go, but it has. Nothing in that one. Try another big one. God, it's a toughie end up smashing the camera. You can smell the sea from it. No, I don't think it's gonna go. Maybe. I think it's just a big lump of metal in there. All the way through. Looks like copper. Marks on it. Try this one. Probably going to break my hammer. Again, I think it's molten copper or copper ore. I don't know. Yeah, you can see all the copper running through it. I think it's just a big piece of molten copper, like this little one. Yeah, just copper, copper, copper. Clear this one out of the way. Do this little baby one. See what's in that. Don't know. Anticlimactical. It's about the size of a musket ball, but it's not the weight of one. So I don't know. A round thing. One of them round things. Well, it looks like the ball peen hammer and the pin are the most exciting thing to come out of it. This little round thing. That we don't know what it is. It could be a musket ball. So that's it. Thanks very much for watching my video. Please make a comment down there, give me a thumbs up, or you can subscribe over here. Please subscribe button over here. Thanks very much.